guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video i have a special guest with us who is going to be talking about some books so here's our special guest so this is natalie this hi. is my best friend natalie hi so <laughs> i'm natalie again <laughs> um so a little bit about myself i'm from the exact same place as kayla <laughs> Uh, we met three years ago. We worked at the same um, boutique. And then here we are three years later. Still friends, still kicking it. Moved across the country with each other, for each other. Yes, it's a secret that nobody knows. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, so Natalie has recently bought some books that are kind of recommendations for me, kind of just her buying books because that's all I talk about. <laughs> But she wanted to share you with you guys some of the books that she's recently bought. So here's a book haul and an introduction because you definitely will be seeing Natalie more in the future on my channel. So what do we have, Natalie? All right. So uh, we're going to start with A House of Salt and Sorrows by Erin A. Craig. Okay. Um, this book from, I haven't obviously haven't read any of these. Um, but quick synopsis of my understanding. Um, so this one's about 12 sisters and they live uh, secluded and then they start dying. Somebody's killing these, these girls. And one of them goes on a quest to save her sisters and herself. So it's like race against time, um, the unknown evil kind of, um, that's my understanding of it. I'm actually really, really excited about this one. Mm -hmm. um, so the second book is what I Left Behind by Jennifer Archer. Mm -hmm. I was actually skimming through Amazon and uh, it talks about a girl or a woman now, mm -hmm. right? Who uh, she had kind of a troubled past. She got pregnant. Um, the father of the child left her and the child, like not knowing that she was pregnant. And then she gives the kid up for adoption and essentially how her past comes to not necessarily haunt her, um, but it comes back. And she goes on yet another quest to uh, figure out what's going on. Okay. Yes, find her baby daddy. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, this book was self-published. I think. So we love indie authors who self-publish. Um, Support them. Yes. So it was self-published. So if you need an indie author or an indie book, this is on Amazon. It's on Amazon. Yes. Um, we have The Invisible Life of Addie LaRue by V.E. Schwab, which Kayla has obsessively talked about. Yes. She's very, very excited about it. Um, I honestly probably wouldn't initially go for a book like this, um, but I wanted to read it with Kayla. And um, it seems, you know, get out of the comfort zone yeah. kind of thing. And so that's that one. So Addie LaRue yes. is about, if you don't already know, which you probably know, but Addie mm -hmm. LaRue is about a woman named Addie LaRue. And she, I think it is the 1800s and she, 500 years prior, makes a deal with the devil. So she is immortal. And one day, the only downside to that is that if she meets someone, they will immediately forget her once she walks away. So she could be talking to someone, go to the bathroom and come back and they have no idea who she is and have no recollection of the conversation they just had. Um, but then one day she goes to a bookstore and she talks to a guy and he remembers her. So then it kind of goes from there. But yeah, I'm, I'm excited for that one. Very excited. And the last one is the Firekeeper's Daughter, um, which I, it caught my attention because it just has a very beautiful cover. Mm -hmm. um, that's what it looks like. <laughs> and uh, and I saw it on Reese Witherspoon's book club Instagram page. And mm -hmm. I was like, oh my gosh, what's that about? And we looked into it and uh, Kayla can probably tell you more about it, but it's about a native girl. Uh -huh. So it's about a native girl and she, on the reservation, I believe, sees a murder happen and kind of tries to solve the murder or help out with the solving of the murder to 
help her people and her community on the reservation. And I, there's probably so much more to that, but that is what I know from what I read of the synopsis. Yes. yes. So that is, that's Natalie's book haul. That's what she's kind of bought. Um, so maybe in like a couple months, we'll come back. She'll talk about these books. She'll let you know how that went. Or maybe in a year, Natalie will say she still hasn't read them. Because we all know that I love to say I'm going to read something and then never, get to. never read it. Because this is the first video that I filmed in almost a month. And I have not finished a book since Nove November. Ooh. I have not finished a book since March 5th. And it is the 26th today, so it's been 21 days and I have yet to finish a book. We'll get there. We'll get there. We'll get I'm, there. That's fine. Get there when we get there. Yep. Um, I have to sneeze, so <laughs> one second. Okay, it went away. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so, any final thoughts for our friends out there? Um, I wanted to say thank you to Kayla for obviously like having me. I really, we've been trying to start a book club since we met. Like yep. me and her have talked about like doing like a little book club since, you know, for three years. Obviously we haven't done anything. This is the first time we've actually um, kind of gotten the same books. I usually read um, Westerns, um, whodunits, um, historical fiction. I really like that. Um, I haven't read a ton like in a while I definitely read I met my 55 book mark last year but I haven't read since the year begun which is I'm I am behind <laughs> I am behind but we will catch up and we I'm catch up. way ahead okay. so my three-week hiatus was okay because I'm <laughs> have read too much this year but yes but thanks for you know having me here so I can get on my stuff, get on my shit about my books and my reading. And, you know, I'm excited to come back and talk about them. <laughs> okay, so that's all Natalie has. So that's all I have. So if you liked this video, please like, comment, subscribe. Do everything you need to do. You know the drill. But I will see you guys in my next video. And we will see Natalie very soon. Because she's a new addition to this channel. <laughs> but, yeah. So... Bye, guys. Bye.